trotters are all moving in behind the gate. And the gate swings into the stretch, and here they come. don't this time I'm darn because Dean Edith Hanover who I tossed thought she'd make a break looked rock solid going to and the you ones know, that are okay mannered are okay too exactly it's, it's the ones that are real nut cases that they They're, seem to have the problems right with. look like uh, five four and three across the wire and winter racing in Cleveland is tough but yeah in the summer when the stake season Jeff is always right there winter racing is ugly no matter how you look yeah. at it mm -hmm. <laughs> Jeff uh, his uh, ex-wife was Joe Marsh Jr.'s daughter. Hence, he has the colors like Joe Marsh Jr. And uh, that's how he got into the game. And he decided he was going to be a driver rather quickly and uh, very brash and very cocky when he got started and drove like that. And he was kind of ahead of his times as far as a front end guy here in Ohio. Winner of the fifth race, number five, Dame Edith Hanover. The T. Cody Trust, Hilliards, Ohio, Charlie Beaver, the winning trainer, Jeff out in the Zonky. They meet at Hanover, home a winner in two minutes and three fifths. Final panel in 30 seconds for lap. And Dame to fan over a typical balanced image jelly, a little bit warm there in the winter circle. And That's usually when it shows. Yeah. Pop out earplugs. Pop out earplugs. There we go. So we've got tie downs, tenon boots, and pop out earplugs. Yeah, they finally showed up. Here's our prices for the 